What's going on, my fellow miners? Welcome back. Sorry, I've been away. Like, I came back, and then I got sick. And uh, my whole family, myself included, we're, we're under the weather. I'm feeling better right now, so I'm able to record this video. So we're going to record it really quick. Uh, those of you guys who have been asking me to do a follow-up video to the whole nice hash removing the, um, the Coinbase instant withdrawal or lightning withdrawal, whatever they called it. I don't remember off the top of my head. But that's what we're going to be doing today. It's going to be a really quick video. Basically, how to connect your Coinbase wallet or any other wallet to NiceHash so you can withdraw uh, your funds to whatever wallet that you want. Now, the benefits to the uh, the instant uh, Coinbase withdrawal, uh, besides the fact that it was free at the time, uh, is also, you know, the fact that it's pretty much instant. It took like five minutes maybe to go ahead and get your money or get your Bitcoin into your Coinbase wallet. Now, uh, now, if you want to withdraw it, it takes up to 24 hours. Sometimes it can take five minutes. Sometimes it can take an hour. Sometimes it can take up to 24 hours. It really just depends on how congested the, the, the network is at the time, if there's any sort of uh, maintenance issues or anything that, that's going on for them to, uh, to adjust it. So just be aware of that. Um, it's a very, very small fee. I think it's like 25 cents. It's just a couple cents to go ahead and, and do it. It's not, a, it's not a big deal. Those of you guys who were saying in my last video, oh, clickbait, clickbait. No, I wasn't clickbaiting. They did withdraw a, you know, one of their best features, which was basically instant, uh, instant withdrawals. So that, that was what the video was about. Um, you know, so a lot of the people were like, oh, it's not that big deal, whatever. It's it's not, but it's still a feature that they removed that, personally, I really liked that feature. Uh, I don't like having to wait for my own money. Uh, anyways, with that, let's go ahead and switch this over to uh, to NiceHash's website so I can go ahead and show you really quick. It's very, very simple. Uh, let's go ahead and do this. All right, so I've already withdrawn... Um, my my bitcoin currently from nice hash so i can't uh, i can't do it right now because i'm i'm still accumulating but <coughs> sorry but uh quick and easy way click on withdraw right here once you click on withdraw you're going to see withdraw to now you won't be able to withdraw to um to coinbase directly like you used to be able to it it should not show up on, i think unless you're on mobile uh it still shows up on mobile but you can't do anything with it um so Basically, you go to add new withdrawal address, and when you click on that, you all you do is put in your Bitcoin wallet address here. So whatever Bitcoin wallet address that you want to send your funds to, that's what you do. If you want to send it to Coinbase, you get your your bit your Bitcoin wallet address from Coinbase and paste it in there. If it's Crypto.com, if it's uh, Binance, if it's your Trust Wallet, your MetaMask, whatever wallet that you want, you go ahead and you put it in there. Once you put it in there, you're going to go ahead and verify uh, that that's, you know, that's the account that you're going to send it to. You can go ahead and name it if you feel like naming it. And once you do, then it's going to be added to your addresses here. And you can go ahead and just click on your addresses to withdraw your Bitcoin. Um, again, like I said, there is a small transaction fee or, or network fee. It's very small. It's like 25 cents. Not a big deal. Uh, you can see right here, processing time is up to 24 hours. Now, I did it earlier today. Um, I didn't record a video on it just at the time because I was in bed, not feeling well. Um, but when I did my withdrawal, I'm going to pull up my emails really quick because I get email confirmation whenever I do the withdrawals. Uh, I got the withdrawal. Let's see. Withdraw request. I actually got it in like five minutes. So I did my withdrawal request. It was at 9, 10 a.m. And then I got my Bitcoin into my Coinbase account at 9, 15. So I got it within five minutes. Um, you know, I've had other instances where it takes a couple hours. Uh, either way, you will get your your Bitcoin. But that's how you do it, guys. It's really not that difficult. Um, if for whatever reason you're having some issues, let me know down in the comment section. I'll see maybe you missed the step. Maybe you missed the letter, a number. I mean, there's not really much troubleshooting that I can do other than that. But I mean, tell me what it says and maybe I'll try to figure it out. But uh, with that, guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate it. I'm 
going to try to record another video while I can, while I, I'm not plagued with a headache. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Everybody, happy mining.